thanks for coming back. You know, you, you never really get to see Terry. He's on the other side of the camera back there, running the second camera and starting and stopping controls. He's waving, you know. You never really get to see much of him. But lately, Terry has been doing his own little video thing. He's got a cool little video recorder. There it is. That's a JVC something or other. Shoots in high def. It's better than the camera we got. <laughs> we need to get another camera is what we need. But Terry's been shooting his own stuff. And it's good stuff. I enjoy watching it. We thought you might too. So have we decided on what we're going to call your thing? You said you were going to call it yeah. something. <laughs> Originally, we called it Road Rebel. Road Rebel, yeah. Which is what we used to, the, the segment that actually led into us doing Editing for Clarity, was our, my Road Rebels. Um, but I think Road Rebel limits, limits it a little bit. Well, you initially wanted me to do my rants while driving, like you used to yeah. do yours. Yeah, yeah. and, 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 and he has done rants be, while driving. That would be stepping on your toes. So, and, and thanks for hitting the microphone on yes, that. Yeah. Yes. Uh, so it's going to be kind of a just a Terry's Terry's thoughts. I don't know if you've got a good name for it. Let us know. I, there we go. Give I us like a, give us give us a good name for it. Uh, but it's it's Terry's thoughts on things. Terry's got a different take on stuff. Uh, so take a look. This is our first installment, Terry, on what the hell happened to customer service. Hey guys, how you doing? Uh, Terry coming to you live. Uh, here it is. A beautiful, overcast, humid, hot, but relatively beautiful Thursday day. Um, hey, I, I'm just curious, has anybody else ever noticed this, especially within the last one, maybe five, ten years? No one seems to smile, say thank you, or please anymore. Um, I just went through the drive through at my local McDonald's on my way to work, and pulled up to the, dry, or the window to give my money. Hi, that's three dollars and twenty-six cents, and that was it. She took my money, sent me on my way. Not even a, a thank you or a have a good day. I pull up to the window. An arm sticks out with my bag. Here you go, and that was it. Not even a thank you. Come again. Have a nice day. Enjoy your meal. Nothing. And it's like, what the hell? Um, I even noticed it when I was working at the stadium. People come up, order their food, or their beers, or their drinks, whatever. Hi, that's $10.50. Not even a please, thank you, come again, enjoy the game, nothing. I don't know if it's my many, many years working customer service related things, working a cash register, greeting people, uh, all my time working at Disneyland where I had to smile no matter what the condition. You have to say please and thank you there. But it's like, I've noticed that sincerity and, um, oh, what am I looking for? Uh, courtesy has gone out the window. It's like, what is up with society anymore? A please, thank you, or even just a smile. You know, it, it, it doesn't take much. What, what's one-tenth of a second out of your life to do something like that? Um, it, it, it's... It's very disconcerting the way our society is going anymore. It's like everybody expects everything to be for themselves and nothing for anybody else. Even when it's your job to not necessarily cater to other people, but you are catering to them. You know, you're providing a service and they're paying you for this service. And all you just acknowledge the fact that give me money. Give me your money. That's all I want. I don't care about anything else. Um, looking back at my, this past season at the, working at the stadium, there were times when I was thoroughly upset. There were times when I was getting my butt kicked because I had no help. I was on my own doing everything. But yet, every guest I encountered, I at least managed to say hello and greet them and, and force a smile. Even though they could tell it's like, oh my God, you know, he's forcing the smile. It was a smile, you know? And when I could, I would joke around with them, have a good time. But 99.98% .98 of the time, I was sincerely genuine in talking with these people, greeting them, and thanking them for their time. Why can't anybody else do this? Am I the only one? Let me know what you think in the comments. Um, I hope I'm not <laughs> offending Leo by stealing his idea of doing a video in the car and saying ask Philly for comments, but I, I figure this is one that anybody and everybody can associate to because we've all been there. So let me know what you think, and I'll talk to you soon. Have a great day, everyone. Bye-bye. Yeah. I agree with Terry.
customer service has just been awful and on a, on a downhill slide for a long time. And I think there's a lot of reasons for it. I think it's, you know, we've gotten to be so much about paying less and trying to get more that we're willing to take the, the abuse or the, the rudeness as long as we get the right price. It's a thought. You know what? Let us know what you think. Tell us what you think about this. Uh, and give us a name for this segment. Uh, especially if you're friends of Terry's because, you know, you know him as well as I do and, you know, he can't think of a name. <laughs> so, Thanks. Get, yeah, no problem. Glad I could help. So, think of a name. Let us know. Also, any of the segments, if you want to give us your opinion on video, we'll put it on. Honest. Put it on and keep the profanity down. You know, it is a public thing and we don't want to get too out of hand. So, you know, if you do get out of hand, I, I will bleep it, but we won't edit it. We'll let you say what you want to say. Um, we'll select the best ones we get every week and we'll, we'll answer it. If you've got a question you want us to ask or it's a topic you want it and you want to submit it, submit it in a comment or submit it in, by video. We'd love to see it. But give us a name for this segment. We'd love to hear what you got to say. We'll be back with our close.